Alright, best George Clo Clooney movie. I can't even say his name right. <sighs> Ocean's Eleven. No. Don't even tell me. No. You know, you know why it's not. Why? It's because he plays that same character over and over mm -hmm. and over again, and he plays himself in Oh Brother, Where Art Thou? Mm. He actually plays a different character. Mm. He has an accent. His whole posture is mm -hmm. changed. Because in real life, you know, George Clooney just robs casinos with his. No, but his whole demeanor, his David actual acting, his actual time. acting chops mm -hmm. is is him. It's not him. It's not him going out of the box. He's in this small little box. And he's like, I'm gonna be this character, and that's all. I am. And oh brother, we're out there. He is like Clark Gable. He does his hair back. He slicks it back all the time. Because there's no makeup people on set to do that for him. No, but he does it himself in the movie. That's the whole point of it. Have you seen the movie? Yes, I've about? seen the movie. Here's the thing about Oh Brother, We're Out There. That's not that it was trendy to like that movie and think it was funny. It's, it's kind of like movie. oh, it's about George Clooney's ah, acting. Ah, and I, think I like George Radiohead. They're a good band, but no, nobody really likes Radiohead. I actually do. Nobody really actually liked that movie. It was just trendy to like it and so people said they liked it when nobody really saw the movie Ocean's Eleven he's the star Danny Ocean okay. over Brad Pitt Matt Damon Casey Affleck Bernie Mac are you kidding me it's like the all star lineup and he's the lead character oh, you know I you're a good actor when you can do that okay you know you're a good actor Two when sequels. you can go out of the box and do something different how, and many, that, how many sequels did Oh Brother it doesn't matter though but this actual character itself was way better than Ocean. I'm mm. sorry, it just was. It totally was. Mm. This movie actually goes, you know what? He has some acting chops because before that, I was a little bored of him. Mm. I was, frankly, I was a little bored of him. I think he's very predictable. And this movie, I did not see it coming. Oh, brother, we're out there. And you know he sings. He's an amazing singer. Hide the women and children. You can't tell me that his role in Ocean's Eleven was just like anything he'd done before yes, that. He is. He'd done like it's Perfect a Storm. Choice. ER in Ocean's Eleven, he was like this okay. baller. You were cheering for the bad guys the whole time. That's how good he was. No, no, but he plays himself. He does not go outside of the box. That's he doesn't true. change his voice. He does not change his whole demeanor of his body. He doesn't change anything about. Just him. changing He's your like, voice doesn't make you. No, a good it's actor. not your voice. It's your whole posture. It's how you. It's how you say things. He changed everything about him to be this character to embody it, and he did it. But was the movie that good? No. It doesn't matter if the movie. It, of course, it's not going to win an Oscar. It's not going to. Didn't have Brad Pitt and everything. Thing, exactly. all those people in it. Of course not, but we're not talking about the other characters in the movie. We're talking about him, his role, what he did best in. Danny Ocean, way better. It's I'm sorry. not. It's definitely Ocean's not. Ocean's Eleven. Oh, because he shoots gun and just goes. Fight. <laughs> He just talks. Yeah. He's blank. That's, He's blank. That's exactly He's what the movie no, does the whole time. Does he have any levels or depth in that character? Because I really don't. Think he really he does. does. I don't think he does. What? Tell there, me, there's tell a me the there's levels. a huge love story going on between him and Julia Roberts. Okay. He's robbing. Uh, look, the storyline absolutely believable. We look up. There, like, there are little things in there that don't really happen in casinos. They don't actually hold the amount of money that's being played upstairs down in the vault that never happens. But in the movie, you totally believe it. You're cheering for the bad guys the whole time. They totally pull off okay. this entire heist. At the end of the movie, it's like Shawshank Redemption. At the end of the movie, you're like, holy crap, that just happened, and wait, how did they do it? Wait, and you're shocked, wait, okay? Wait, and I'm, George Clooney no. was leading it the whole way. Oh, crazy, but I'm pretty sure he was a bad guy and oh brother were out there. He got out of jail. He helped his friends out. It was he a got, good movie. It doesn't matter if it was yes, a good movie. Yes, it was. His yes, character it does. was, no, you know what? His character in this movie was better. It took more, he went to more levels. He, ugh, it's just, that movie is better. For uh, him my two sequels, no. I okay, win. He's sorry, I was just 11, 12, and 13. Played Not himself. Not playing himself. You can use Sucked. that excuse all. Sucked. Win. No. Win.